Praise be Jesus Christ. So I was talking to a buddy of mine who builds stuff and we're talking about how are we going to get a, a ladder or a staircase up to my treehouse cabin here. And as we were chatting, I kind of sheepishly mentioned to him, I said, oh, you know, my dream was to have a spiral staircase going up to uh, my cabin. And my buddy shocks me. He says, well, I have an old spiral staircase kicking around. You'd be welcome to have that. Now you tell me, how many people just happen to have a spiral stair staircase sticking around? And so there it is, spiral staircase leading up to the cabin. Now I have a scripture for you. Oh, do I have a scripture for you? It's Psalm 37. <laughs> the scripture is delight in the Lord and he will grant you your heart's desires. Now, you know, I promote devotion to God the Father. And especially through the revelations uh, from Mother Eugenia. And one of the key parts of the message is the God who made you loves you infinitely. And he wants you to be his son, to be his daughter, and to discover his fatherly love, that he is a good, good father who wants to lavish his blessings upon you. And, and as it says in Psalm 37, delight in him and he will grant you your heart's desires. Now, part of this devotion that I, uh, that I promote and encourage, the uh, revelations of Mother Eugenia, the father speaks to his children, is so many people who embrace this devotion and this message, they speak of all these little miracles. When we turn to the father who loves us as his little children and delight in him, he blesses us. He's so good to us. Yes, there's still trials and, and, and crosses to carry, but he's a father who loves to surprise his children with his goodness. So this, my little example here with my spiral staircase, this is one little miracle among many that I've experienced since I've discovered this beautiful revelation from Mother Eugenia about God the Father's love. And again, I could give you so many examples of little miracles. So I proclaim to you that the God who made you, he is your loving Abba Father of infinite goodness and he wants to pour out his goodness, his blessings upon you. He wants to grant you your heart's desires. And your call is to learn to delight in the God who made you, who is your father. And so, as I mentioned a while ago, during the month of August, I'm doing a four-part series on the love of God the Father in my school of reading. I already did the first teaching, and I'm going to be doing three more uh, based on these revelations, but also based on uh, sacred scripture. So if you're interested, we'll send you a copy of uh, The Father Speaks to His Children. Once they arrive, uh, we'll send you immediately a PDF so you can join in our teachings right away. Um, but we're also throughout the whole month of August, anyone who signs up for the School of Reading, we're going to send you Susan Werner's beautiful poems, Poems for the Soul. This is going to be our book uh, in a few weeks that we'll be studying. And so we're sending this out to everyone who signs up for the School of Reading in the month of August. Beautiful poems that will bring joy to your soul. And I have one more scripture for you today as I continue to marvel at the little miracle of my buddy having a spiral staircase. Okay, this is Genesis chapter 28. And he dreamed that there was a ladder set up on the earth and the top of it reached to heaven and behold the angels of God were ascending and descending on it and so if you're interested in joining the school of reading go to schoolofreading.com viva cristore